Hello and welcome to another DaddyJamesFilms.Webs.com video tutorial. In this tutorial, we're going to redo how to download movies, games, and music for free, a U-turn tutorial. I've done a tutorial on this before. Uh, it's uh, download free movies files with U-turn, DVD flick, image burn, download free movies files part one and then part two and stuff like that. Well, I decided to go ahead and redo this, okay? So we're going to start all the way back at the beginning. Hopefully, I might be able to answer some of you guys' questions about Mooturn as I go along. One of the more popular questions is, uh, how come uh, DVD Flick, it takes so long? Well, it's a free program. If you want something that's not going to take so long, uh, download some other programs that you have to pay for, like uh, Nero or something like that. Now, to get the uh, Mooturn, what you need to do is open up your web browser and then you want to go to download.com or you can go there and download it or you can just type in go to Google here and type in uTorrent and you can go to the uTorrent website and then you can download it from here um, you click on it Okay, it's going to actually to save the file, and then you just save it to your desktop or wherever you want to uh, save it to. Also, you'll need Firefox. Okay, um, you need Firefox browser in order to do this. Internet Explorer doesn't really work very good with this, and plus, Internet Explorer pretty much sucks anyways. Okay, once you have downloaded, it shouldn't take very long to download. It should take like a second or two. But you'll get the install, and it'll look like this. Basically, what you do is just install it. Uh, now, if you have Komodo or any other firewalls, you might have to get it approved through your firewall. Wow. Wow. Okay, if you have a firewall or anything like mine, to ask your permission on doing all that all that stuff <laughs> as you can see my file wall came up again and you just keep, gotta keep on accepting it <laughs> okay once you accept it accept it through your firewall um, once it's done uh, installing it should come up with this right here. First thing you want to do is pick where you want all your. Well, it's going to ask you, do you want MooTorrent to be your default application? Default torrent application. Just click yes. And I'm going to use the regular settings. Now, the first thing you want to do is you want to go to options up here, preferences. Now, you want to go to directories. And you want to set to where you want all your files to be downloaded at. Right now I ain't got none set, so let me go ahead and make one in my documents. Okay, I made a folder into my documents. Now I'm gonna click on this button right here, and it's gonna ask me where to uh, search for the file where I want all my downloads to go to. So I'm gonna go to my documents. And my return downloads. There you go. I selected that folder. Now I know where all my downloads is going to go. Now you can either hit apply or you can hit OK. And there you go. You got U turn set up and ready to go. Now, now what you need to do is you need to have a zip extractor program. Uh, because a lot of times when you download movies and stuff, uh, you're going to need a uh, zip extractor. To get a zip extractor, you need to go to download.com or wherever else that you might know where to find one out. You can get it from there. Now, once we're in download.com, you have a few choices. There are a few good one, free ones out there that you can get. Um, you can get TugZip, OwlZip, 7-Zip. I suggest you get 7-Zip, okay? You can get the other ones that you want, but what you really want to get is 7-zip because sometimes 7-zip or a zip unzip a file that the others won't do. 
So I've typed in 7-zip up here in the search area. Then I went down, down here. Don't worry about the advertisements. Don't click on those. Uh, go down right here where you see 7-zip. You can click on 7-zip if you want to read a little bit about it. And as you can see, you got uh, five stars here. Uh, you just download that. Save the file. Save it onto your desktop. Okay, as that's saving, I'm going to show you some other ones. It's Tug, Zip. I can see it's a pretty good one. It only got four. Uh, but it's still a good one. Uh, another one is Al Zip. Al Zip. I'll zip. The editor gave it four stars and the users gave it four stars. And then of course is uh, another favorite of mine is Winwar. Let's see if they have Winwar here. Yeah, here you go. The editors gave that a five stars. User gave it uh, four stars. But my suggestion is number one, get seven zip. And number two, you get Renoir, but unfortunately, it's only free to try. Now, you can end up getting like a, uh, a free crack version one of Renoir. Uh, just go onto your turn site, which I'll show you here in a minute, and get one. But 7-Zip should do you fine, but if you want Renoir, like I said, go onto your turn site and download one from there. Now, once you have your Zip Distractors, the only thing you need now is a site to where you download your turrets at. Now there's a couple of good ones. I'll show you both of them. Okay, the first one I'm going to show you is called Mini Nova. To get Mini Nova, just go to mininova.org. Okay, or you can go onto Google and type in Mini Nova. And it should be the first link. When you type in Mini Nova, it should be the first link. Click on that. It'll bring you to this page. Now, on this page, the first page, one thing I like about Mini Nova, it gives you some uh, feature turns on there. And on the, on, the, on the first page. And as you can see right here, is a bunch of turns on feature turns. And they also have some anime turns, book turns game turrets, movies, music, pictures, software, TV shows, and other, and many, many other ones. But anyhow, if you're looking for something in particular um, to download, like a movie or a software or something like that, so let's just do, mm, I'm going to do like I did on my other video and just put WWE. Because I like wrestling. Okay, on, on WWE, it came up with a bunch of WWE videos. Okay. Now, if you use like a movie or something like that, it'll just have just that movie. But I just type in WWE and it gave me all the WWE videos. Okay, let's say it's not just, it's not a particular WWE video I want. Uh, let's just say I want the one that has the most seeds in it. Okay, that's it for part one. Click right here for part two.